Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Today Tunbridge Angels are away to Yeovil Town in the National League South. So what are your thoughts on today's game? Yeah, it's amazing isn't it? Tunbridge Angels are away to Yeovil Town in a league game. I can't believe that really. Um, when we worked out last night didn't we? When they were in the Championship nine years ago. Yeah. Um, yeah, but uh, no, they've, they've run a bad time. But they're, they're one of the biggest clubs in the league. Um, it'll be one of the, the, the biggest, nicest stadiums we go to. Um, so I really can't wait. It's a big, big special occasion for the club. Yeah, really looking forward to this game today. This was this was probably the fixture I was looking for when the fixtures came out. To be honest, um, you know, as I said, um, you know, they were, um, less than ten years ago they were in the championship. Uh, I've had four relegations, which is you know very poor for uh, for their point of view. Um, uh, but yeah, I mean, they're obviously one of the biggest clubs. They're going to be a massive attendance and a massive ground. So I can't wait for today's game. So what's your score prediction? Well, you know, we're not going to be a pushover. We won our last two, playing really well at the moment, and all the pressure is on Yeovil. I think we'll come away with a point, 1-1. One, one. Um, yeah, my prediction is going to be 2-1 to Yeovil. Um, they do uh, look one of the favourites to win the league, as obviously they're way too big for this league. Um, I have seen through the results that they seem to be the experts at scoring late goals, so um, so obviously we better not, uh, if we do go ahead, don't celebrate too early. But anyway, um, uh, going to be an interesting one there on seven and we're six points, but hopefully we win and I'll see you inside Hewish Park. Go 
Yes. Go on. Oh. Definitely, as you can't. You've got the power to know you're indestructible. Always believe in the risk. Go! Go on, go on, go on! Go on. Go on. Oh! <laughs> games and I think you've probably got to accept the other team are better and they have been in the first half. It's 1-0 to Yeovil and could have been more um, and we're, I'm going to say not taking our chances, not really had the chances in the first half. I'm sure things will be better in the second half and what a lovely place to go as well. I mean it's been absolutely pouring rain most of the first half. The pitch is very wet um, and it's a lovely ground to sit in but at the moment um, Yeovil are um, deservedly ahead. Yeah I think that you know Yeovil have just been all over us. Um, yeah I mean I suppose it's a good thing it's only 1 0 really, but um, yeah, they obviously over haven't really finished very well because they do look very dangerous on the break and we look absolutely exp exposed. And um, you know, it's a bit of a shame. We, we have, haven't had many good chances. There were a couple opportunities that had we had shot, we might have scored, but we didn't, and that was a bit, a bit annoying. Um, but yeah, let's hope we turn it around second half. But I'll be honest with you, I think Yoko have got the three points in the bag really. I'll see you in the second half. Go on. Go on, go on. Oh! oh. I think that. Go on. Go on. Oh. oh no. Oh no. Lewis, go, go! 
Tunbridge Angels nil, so what are your thoughts on the game? Uh, I've just I really enjoyed the game. I thought it was, it was a terrific match today. Um, I think Yeovil deserved to win. We put in a really good performance in the second half. Um, I thought, um, uh, particularly defensively, um, didn't really like scoring, unfortunately. But um, yeah, we weren't far off Yeovil. That's very encouraging. And um, it was a really good experience in a lovely ground. And the weather was uh, awful, but we stayed dry because we were undercover. Yeah. So yeah, what a, what a brilliant weekend away. Yeah, it was a it was a good game, you know. Uh, obviously disappointing to lose, but um, I felt that we didn't really have much chances, but we certainly did very well to reduce the scoreline. Um, it was one nil for absolutely ages, and we did really well to stick to one nil until they got their second goal at the end uh, when we were pushing for an equaliser. Um, but yeah, I suppose you know again you can't judge anything from the first five games of the season. We played two of the league title favourites away already, so. Um, as I said, like we've done really well so far based off that. Um, and uh, yeah, it was just weird, you know, having our own away end and um, having our own, uh, you know, having a concourse. And uh, I'm not not used to that at all, watching Tunbridge, not, not to mention, at, you know, see a go and the crowd absolutely erupt when a goal. We're not used to that at all. So uh, yeah, that was a, a bit weird. But anyway, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.